This is a digital photocolorimeter. We are going to use it to measure serum calcium level. Let's get into it. These are the cuvettes or test tubes that came with the machine. And this is the reagent kit that we got. Here is our reagent number 2 named as R2 which is actually a buffer. And here is our reagent number 1 which is chrysophthalein complex zone. And the third chemical we have is the calcium standard. You can see the concentration of the calcium standard is 10 mg per deciliter. Now, first of all, we are going to make the working reagent. I have already labeled my cuvettes. This one is B or blank, which will contain only the working reagent. This one's S and it will contain working reagent and the sample. This is labeled as CA. Hence, will contain working reagent and the calcium standard. This is the protocol we are gonna follow. In the blank cuvette, we will take only 1 ml of working reagent. In the sample test tube, we are gonna take 1 ml of working reagent with 10 microliters of sample. And in the third cuvette, we are gonna take 1 ml of working reagent with 10 microliters of calcium standard. We are ready to take the sample now. Now it's time to take the calcium standard. We have to mix the chemicals now. In another cuvette, we are going to take distilled water for the calibration of the machine. We have to remember that this is a two-step calibration test. So we have to calibrate the machine first with distilled water and then with the blank reagent. Now we will leave the reagents for two minutes. In the meantime, we are going to turn the machine on and wait for five minutes as mentioned in the protocol. At this point, we have to adjust the disc. As per the instruction, we have to take the reading at 570 nanometers and the manual says it falls within the green range. So we have to set the disc to green, which is 54. So it's already been 5 minutes since we started the machine. Now we are going to calibrate the machine. For that, we are going to put the distilled water in the housing of the machine and we have to gently push the cuvette and make sure the two white lines align together. Now we see that the reading is minus 0.18. We have to set it to zero by rotating the knob. Now we have to calibrate the machine again, now with the blank reagent. Well, we are ready for the test now. First, we are going to take the readings for the sample. Here, the absorbance of the sample is 0.10. Let's take the reading for the calcium standard. The absorbance of the calcium standard is 0.16. We can calculate the calcium level now by dividing the absorbance of the sample which is 0.10 and the absorbance of the standard which is 0.16. Then we'll multiply it with the concentration of the standard which is 10 mg per deciliter. So the calcium level in our sample is 6.25 mg per deciliter. 